guys, welcome to another Breath of the Wild video. We're in the same place. I'm just gonna get us across over to that shrine. So this will take a hot minute, but yay for editing. Okay, we're getting closer. I did think about the fact that the better way would have been to just climb this and then uh, glide over. Uh, and, you know, at the time I was like, eh, it'll take a while to swim over there and then climb the mountain. But now I'm thinking, no, that would have been quicker. <laughs> this is a lot of ice cubes I'm having to put up. And, uh, yeah. So, but I feel like we're invested now. We're, we're really close to it. I can literally see the surrounding area. So, yeah. We're just a little too invested. So I'm gonna just keep doing it this way. Because it's been five minutes. Which isn't long, but, you know, that's five minutes less you have to watch. Honestly, probably, let's just say ten minutes that you won't have to watch because, uh... Because it'll probably take me another five minutes. Oh, what the fuck? I did not mean to do that. But yeah, it'll take me another five minutes to get that far away. <laughs> now it's beeping. Good thing I have eyesight. Because, like, how the hell would you ever get the alert for this one? I, I guess if you're on the other side of the mountain, because it's kind of closer to that area than anything. I want to just swim to it, but because it's in water, I have to be careful about that. There's, there's no, like, there's nothing that can really save us along the way. And I can't, uh, I can't be standing in water to place one of these, so. So I think we'll just, we'll place a couple more. And then I should be able to swim. Damn it. That's not what I meant. Okay, I think we can swim the rest of the way. Like, like I swear to God, if we can't make this swim... Which is actually... Almost the case. I think we will make it, but man, it was getting a little worrisome there. Hey, there's a blue shell. Oh, and here's a uh, thingamabobber. Which one is it? Aw, oh, damn, they, that's why the raft is here. How do you get the raft to go? Shit. I don't know. That's that's why the raft is there, though. Oh, I guess the paddle? I have that paddle. Let's see. Is that how it goes? Yeah, I'm not sure. I feel like we would have had time to just get to it, though. You think we can swim? Okay, hold on. I swear, if we drown, I'm gonna be pissed. I almost should have saved, right? Uh, make it, make it, because I can't, I can't, um, I can't risk the, uh, there, we made it. 
I was gonna say, I can't risk using dash because we might drown. Nice. Bye bye. You could at least give me a lift back. Yay for the raft. The raft does help a bit. <laughs> it just being there. Even if it doesn't move. Okay. Anything else around here? A rock leaf? What's this out in the distance? Oh shit, do I have... Do I have some mob in the water? It felt like it. Oh, that's just a box. Okay. It's not a box we can open. And I don't believe I can... Let's see. Yeah, I can't... I can't grab it. Okay, let's do this. There is a lot of shrines. I wonder if there's a way in in the game settings to know whether you've gotten them all later on. Because uh, cause I will, of course, want to 100% all the shrines. Um, but there is a lot. I could see it being fairly easy to miss one. Test of strength. Is this another fighting one? Oh, you know what? We should not be fighting with a paddle. Okay. Hey, buddy. How much health do I have on me? Oh, okay, so he hits for a good chunk of health. Okay. You want to be that way? Okay. His health is, like, barely going down. There, there's gotta be a... There's gotta be a better method to this. Like... Okay, let's... Okay, that is only a 24. Fine, let's swap to the 52. And see how the health is at that point. It still feels like this guy's health. Is it about getting him to smash into stuff? Like, is that... Is that the trick here, or...? Like, is that doing more damage than I am? Man, he's not even half. Man, I can't move. Damn it. 
damn it. I feel like I'm using way too many shock arrows. Like, I didn't buy shock arrows to fucking do this shrine. <laughs> I bought them to, like, how many, how many do I have? I have 22. Yeah, I'm just gonna say, there's gotta be a better technique. Like, I know shock arrows are good on these guys, but... But, it's like, I've used eight. Ah, oh, damn. I forgot about that one. Damn. There's not enough pillars, so it's hard to get them behind one. It's like, he's slowly going down, but it does suck how slowly it is. He's doing his thing. That shit's like a one-shot kill. Get moving. goes my weapon. Yeah, because I don't know if there was a, a better way. I swear to God. Yeah, he's clearly he's yeah, I can't even I can't even get him to Damn it. I can't e oh, I don't even that might be the end anyway. Oh, thank God. That got close. Why, why was that so fucking tough? I don't know. 
Okay, but it's done. Guardian Sword plus plus. Very nice. Um, but yeah, you know, my weapon right now is still better. Uh, the worst part of these, but you know, the thing is, you just do it the one time, you know, like. These are plus pluses, though. Not bad weapons, I will say. Um, here, we'll pick these up. Get some decent ancient gear out of it. Okay, I do want to pick these weapons up because they are pretty good. They're not as good as my 72, but they are still good. I'm still a little bummed in everything we used to fucking do that. Like, well, what we got for arrows? Yeah, I gotta go buy. We need to do the quest so that I'm not spending. You know, I even, I even prepared for that too. I bought 30 so that we'd have 10. Like, ugh. We, I'm gonna go, actually, I can't even replenish because we bought all of them. So, fuck. I don't know. We might need to hit up a new town. We'll see. Okay, anywho, um, let's... We'll toss this one, I guess. Okay. Okay, let's uh, finish this off. And we'll just swap to a not as good weapon. Oh, fuck yeah. Nice. Climb speed up. Very nice. I like it. Okay. Okay, I guess I can't complain too much. It was it was tough and I guess it it was definitely worth it. If for anything that chess piece Nice. We're gonna spend some of that in this video. The The past couple of videos, including this one, have definitely been, you know, um, some random stuff because we were just kind of go, go, go on those shrines for so long that we need stuff. So, I'm just gonna, um, I'm just gonna have us port over here, make it a little faster. And I don't know what we're going to do for shock arrows because, like, I'd, I don't know if this is really the case, but I feel like things don't replenish. So if you buy all of something, like, y you've bought all of their stock, it, it just will never... Yeah, so I think we have to hit up another town in order to get more shock arrows, which means, in the end, you gotta be careful with your arrows. At least the special ones. I'm gonna just see for the hell of it. But I'm pretty sure that will be... Yeah. Oh! 
I think I see shock arrows. Okay, take that back. Maybe I just never came back <laughs> to some of the towns to see if they replenished. Now, the only problem is, um, they're, they're kind of pricey. So, we're gonna try to not use any sh and a bunch of shock arrows. Like, should I? I, I don't want to just go spending all my fucking money, right? I think what we need to do is we need to go hand in that quest. Yeah. So... I don't know if it'll get done in this video, but we'll buy one batch. Yeah. And that puts us to 21. And... And then we will hand in that quest. Yeah, it's this one. Oh shit, it's the actual Varuda one. Fuck. Well, I guess it probably is due time that I do that one. I'm still doing these memories. I need to, um, I need to explore more before we can get all those memories. Um, but I've been collecting them in a folder, so once I have all the memories, I'm gonna do, like, one big video that shows off all the memories. Yeah. I, um... Like, this is basically just a for fun gameplay series, but, you know, people might want to have a little memories video anyway. Okay, so we're back to having enough shock arrows. Um, hopefully that'll just be enough because I don't want to spend another 140. Uh, where is Chicky? I think... Oh, do you have another fucking quest? Who's this? You a traveler? I'm a fisherman of this village, but we're in a bit of a bind lately. Monsters have taken over the best fishing spots. You used to be able to pull in a good haul at Eris Beach, but these days you'd be lucky to leave there with your life. You look pretty tough. Could you take care of them? I've probably already beat them, but, you know, they respawn, so... Oh, did I just hand it in? Yeah, I must have just immediately handed it in. Yeah, because I've probably... <laughs> yeah, yeah, it was probably one of the things I did. Always funny when that happens. Okay. Nice, I needed... I needed the rupees. Okay. Here's Chicky. That can't go shopping for ingredients. There you go. Nice. Holy shit. Damn. And I'm just gonna say, I'd, I don't know if it had other ingredients that you had on hand. Um, but, you know, all I gave you was a snail and goat butter. <laughs> nice. Cool, cool. Okay, so let's see. Yeah, there was definitely more. But still, not bad. I think I have all that. I have no use for a 12 heart food, but eventually we will. And pretty much, I think the, the only thing I might be out of is rock salt because I've used it many times. But yeah, let's see. Yep. Only one, but I have it. Hylian rice. 
Um, I think that's rock salt. Yeah, I have two rock salt. And uh, mm, I think one was a mighty porgy, but like I could either go fish it or just go buy one at the, the fish store there. Yeah, so I have all the stuff for that. I like that it shows the recipe. The only bad part is you have to have one on you to see the recipe. But it's still nice that it shows. Oh, those don't stack. Jeez. That's okay. Oh, those are easy to make. Okay, I do need to make some food. <laughs> I also, don't I have a... I have a royal... Um, where's side quests that aren't complete? Yeah, right there. Royal recipe. What What was I needing? Whoops, I didn't mean to do that. It was to make something. I just can't remember. Oh, yeah. I need cane sugar, which I don't have. And I don't think we've made it to a town yet that sells cane sugar. I think I want to go to Hatino. Actually, wasn't there a reason we were being asked to go to this village anyway? I just don't know if we completed the task for it. I just chose it because I kind of know exactly where the spirit orb person is. So I can just like go straight to them. And then I believe the leaf that I've had on the map is where we can spend our seeds. <laughs> I think this this town or village was like one of my favorite episodes I actually did for this. It was just such a fun town. Oh, the arrows, that's right. I remember that one too. I wonder um I'm trying to remember. I think the arrows for this town was in a building. Oh, there's the orb. Okay. You have conquered the shrines. Sure have. I always want to take stamina vessel. And we really probably should. But I like having all the hearts. Yeah. But, but yeah, I totally should be taking the stamina vessel. But the way I see it is we can just make stamina food. <laughs> I just always want the hearts. Plus, it sucks when you make all this food that is, like, more hearts than you even are missing. Yeah. So... Heart container, please. Yay. I love the way the heart container looks. Thank you. Yay. Yeah, I'll take another heart container.
Yay. Okay, so we have how many? Two, four, six, eight. Who do you appreciate? Okay. So that's that. Uh, while we're here, I'm just going to see if I was right about the arrows being... I believe it's... It says potions, but I'm pretty sure arrows are in here. Let's see. Yeah. Yeah. It just looks like a potion, but... Okay. Oh, you have it. That's what I get, right? I haven't come to this town in a while. Of course they want more tasks. Uh, promise you're gonna you're gonna have to remind me, Rolla. It's it's been roughly probably forty hours since I you know forty hours gameplay since I've been to this town. Yeah, I have fifty plus hours on this game at this stage in the game. So yeah, in case anyone's curious, yeah, we're we're sitting at around fifty hours so far. But that is 50 hours of shrines, um, exploration, towers, side quests. I've done a lot of side quests. And we're pretty we're pretty progressed in like the main quest. I'm on Divine Beasts right now, so yeah. You forgot already? You were oh okay. Yeah. I thought you were giving me a new one. Okay. So, regular arrows. Okay. There's fire arrows. Okay. Oh. Mm, just two of them? Okay, I'll take them all. I need some. That hurt a bit. <laughs> it, it's money wise has hurt today because uh, we had to replenish. I need to figure out where some more bomb arrows are because we went through a bunch of those as well. I had I had ten today and we spent them. So, but so far we're not doing too bad. You know, I have spent some ice arrows, but I'm not too concerned with the ice arrows. But Fire arrows, definitely. And the bomb arrows, I just really like them. <laughs> yeah. They're good for when things are really far away, but they're close enough that they're attacking you. Like, for example, my last couple that I used, it was mobs that were on a tower that was in the middle of the water, but I was still in range enough for them to be attacking me. Yeah. And I needed them to die because there was it was one of those deals where you kill everything in the area to open up the chest. Yeah. So. Okay. So we are good here. Okay. So I've replenished most of what I wanted to replenish that we're we're doing good I have I have a good chunk of arrows now um yeah okay so now that I have fire arrows I guess um I guess I have exactly 10. Jeez, I wonder if I should get some more. Okay. Oh man, it's just pointing me to her. It's just point. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> okay, where do you want me going for this? Light the torches by the goddess statue. 
Oh, you know what? It's where we were spending our orbs. That's the goddess statue. Uh, what side are we on right now? Oh, there, there we go. So it's set 10, but I only see four torches, so I don't know. Let's hope for the best. Oh, does she want them, like, lit together or something? Because it, it goes out. Shit, did I just waste? Okay. Okay, we made a fire. And hopefully it stays lit. Okay, so, I think, okay, I think this is how you're supposed to do it, because it's the, yeah, I'm hoping anyway, it's the only way they're staying lit, so I did waste a bunch of fire arrows, and then I used one to make this fire, but, um, but, yeah. If it gets the mission complete, then I'm okay with it, I guess. Nice. Okay. So that's how you do that. Do not waste your fire arrows. Well, you can use one to build that fire, because that's how I made that fire. But then use regular arrows after that. I uh, yes I am. Thank you. I could use some uh, fire arrows in the reward. <laughs> Just saying. Aw. That really was something special to see. In fact, here's a token of my thanks. Thank you. If only my husband hadn't been become obsessed with cuckoos and had kept up with his archery skills. If only. Okay. Well, unfortunately now I feel the need. Oh, do they? Oh, no. But yeah, now I feel the need to buy more because I used a bunch. Oh. How much is 10? Oh, ouch. 200 rupees. Ouchie. But... It'll get us 14 in total. Do it. Man. We are getting further and further away from our house quest. I have one for a house. That we need to raise 3,000 rupees for. And I just keep spending the rupees. That's why I think at some point we're probably going to do that gamble in that other town that we were in. Okay, so I've pretty much done all my spending. Um, I, I'm not sure if I can buy bomb arrows. Let's see. Okay, um, what's this one? The dye shop. Okay, that's how my outfit's purple. I remember doing that. General goods? Okay, this might be it. Walk in, check. Yeah, there's, uh, yeah, bomb arrows right there. Okay, so how much? 350 for a batch of 10. Oh, that's a lot. What am I thinking? 350. Damn, that is a lot. Oh, God. Dude. 
It don't worry. Don't worry. I will I do need to buy them. Hey, is this uh Yeah, I should buy some more of that while we're here. Bird egg. Five. I don't know. Let's buy four. Ugh. It would be all my money if I went and bought these bomb arrows. Oh my goodness. I really need to start selling stuff. I have nothing I want to sell, though. Oh, I forgot about the fairy. The fact that they increase... Yeah, I totally forgot about the fairy increasing your gear and stuff. Man. Well, we could buy five. It would still be less than I had before. Unless I just... I don't know. We we came here. We might as well get some. Fresh milk. What's this? Hardy truffle. Okay. Let's, let's do five. Damn. But at least we'll have them. Okay. Oh my god, we are so broke now. <laughs> okay, let's get out of here. Okay. Okay, we we have our, our arrows back, though. So there is that. Yay. Um, but we are so broke. Yay for the fact that we did good on that gambling thing earlier. Which might have been in another video. I'm recording many videos in one day, so... Yeah, so that might have happened in, like, the last video. Okay, there's one more thing I want to do before we end this. Just so that we've got all our spending kind of dealt with. We're gonna go to where I have this leaf. Because I do believe that's the seed person. So, uh, let's just go here. Okay, well, we're at the leaf. And I do remember the guy here, but he might... He might not stay, you know? When it comes to the seed guys, they might... They might shift... Where they are. Which is kind of a bummer, how you're supposed to keep track of them. Okay, okay, I just looked into it. It turns out he moves after you upgrade twice. And this is where he starts, which is why I would have had that icon there. So the next area he goes to is Riverside, which we do have. So, I said north of, so let's go, let's go here. Okay, so here we are. Oh, he's right there. Nice, right in front of the shrine. Okay, awesome. So, let's, let's draw a, because I will totally forget. However, he does move if we upgrade twice, so he might not be here in a bit. But at least I would know where to go, so we'll put another one there. So we do. Oh, I don't know which inventory space I want, though. Because you have to choose which category. I sure have. 
Um, actually, hold on. Yeah, just a sec. Let's see. What have I upgraded? Okay, it looks like I put one into bows. I've never really felt a need for shields because I pretty much very seldom break a shield. I guess weapons. Yeah. Like if we start unlocking some more arrows, I don't know if there is any more to unlock, but yeah. Men. We could have used that arrow probably on that that shrine that had that tough guy. Huh. I think we're good here though. Yeah, let's put it in weapons. Okay. Weapon stash. Yeah, go for it. <laughs> okay, nice. Da -na 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 -na. Okay. I've got enough to do one more because I think it goes up every time, which means this is the third upgrade. So the next one, he's probably going to want four, which I believe I have four and then he'll move and the next place he moves to is Lake Hylia which I'm not sure if I have opened up I'd have to see uh, do you want to expand another stash sure put put it in weapon again oh you need five this time damn it okay never mind I'll be back Okay. It's okay, Hestu. I'll be back. So I wonder if... Does he keep bouncing back and forth? Because, like... You know... There's like a hundred seeds. Yeah, so at some point, he must just stay somewhere. Oh, okay. Okay, I just looked it up. He stays at Korok Forest. So... After I do one more at this location, he will move to he'll move to Lake Hylia. And then Woodland Stables, which I think I have. Pretty sure. Woodland Stables. I'm so sure I had that. Maybe I thought, yeah, because this one's Foothill Stables, so maybe. But Woodland Stables would be, in, you know, after the next one, and then he stays at Korok Forest. So, so I don't think we need to keep this here then, because he won't return back to that first destination. So we can delete that stamp, keep that one there, and yeah. One last thing I want to do, just to polish off this video, so we'll just go over here and we're going to make some food. Bright-eyed crab, raw meat. Okay. Okay, I only have five, but whatever. Oh, the bright crab is no longer... Right beside the meat. <laughs> Hold and it makes you wonder. Oh, okay, never mind. Okay, cook up some stamina.
I'll probably grab a few more for stamina. Man, that one's gonna sit in our inventory for a while. Like, I I only have eight hearts total. Mm, let's see if... Oh, we have spicy pepper. Hold. Let's see. See what that cooks up to be. Okay, it's one heart. Low level cold resistance. Very nice. If I made a couple together. Okay, cook that up. That should be worth two hearts. Yeah. And five minutes for mid-level cold resistance. Okay. So we'll hold on to that. Okay, let's do a vol fruit. Uh, what's this? Okay. Um, do a radish. Fresh milk. Mm, I'm looking for hydromelon. Do I not have any? Oh, right there. Okay. This should make a creamy heart soup. You just put a jar of milk in the pot. <laughs> oh shit, I did not think it was gonna make a 11 heart food. <laughs> oh god. Yeah, I I like that we're making new things, but I I'm still yeah, a little behind in the hearts. Yeah, we got to do some more shrines. Okay. Let's make uh we have Hylian shroom. Okay, let's add that. And then let's add some rice. Okay, and this should make mushroom rice balls. <laughs> nice. So that's just some basic food, which a lot of the time I just want some basic food, but decent hearts. Um, but three isn't a whole lot, so Let's see if we can find something that's at least five. I guess what I could do is if we do, I've got quite a bit of these. So if we do that, hold on to two of those and then let's just do some mushrooms because I don't have a whole lot of rice. But I do have a good chunk of mushrooms. And a good chunk of Hylian mushrooms. Let's just, yeah, let's let's do four. See, see what it gets us. Okay, that's not bad. Okay. Do we have any vegetables or flowers or... Oh, there's some flowers right there. Let's do... Um, cook it to increase your stealth. Um, that's all we have for flowers. How is it that I don't have that many flowers? Seems kind of weird. Okay, anyway, I'm gonna 
grab a couple there. Um, I only have one of these, so I don't want to use it all. Okay. Cook that up. Okay, that's six. And we got a low-level stealth boost. Okay, how are we doing for space here? Okay, we got three spots left. Okay, we could do a seafood version of uh, rice balls. <laughs> so let's do... We'll use one of these fish. Oh, this one will give us resistance to electricity. What's this one? Uh, yeah, let's just do some basic food. Although electricity resistance is nice, but... Nice. Okay. And we're probably filled. Uh, not yet. Mm. Seeing if there's something we should put in here for stats. I have two stamina, two cold. Um, yeah, stealth boost. Okay, let's just get some basic food in here. Hmm, should I mix it with anything? Yeah, fuck it. We'll just do... Five. Cook. And then I think I'll do some bananas. Yeah, perfect. And let's cook up some bananas. And then we'll be full on that tab. Oh. Damn. We have high level attack power. So bananas are good for attack power. Okay. So we are... We are full there, so... I need to start using these, um, these elixirs. I should have used one on that battle. Okay. Anyway, uh, that concludes this video. This video might have been a little extended because of everything I wanted to do. But we're, we're good now. Um, I've replenished our arrows. So we have, you know, we, we got an extra space for weapons. And, you know, we have two extra hearts on our character. And um, the arrows are replenished. Aside from, like, five of the bomb arrows just these are very pricey there's 350 for every 10 so i just bought five um hopefully we'll just loot more so i don't have to purchase more um but yeah and i think just so we get it done in the next video i think we might actually go do the quest that involves these shock arrows just so i don't accidentally use them and uh yeah and that's one of the divine beasts so that would be a major thing getting done and uh and yeah and then we made some food i still have tons of materials here and yeah so we used up some stuff there 
So I think we're good to go. Yeah, the major reason for the food was really the stamina. Um, because some of those towers can be a bitch. And there's nothing worse than getting to a tower and then finding out you can't even climb it. And you've got no travel point nearby because the tower is your travel point, right? Yeah, so... So yeah. Anyway. That's that. And, uh, I'm gonna go back to... Was it Hatino Village that I was at, or was it Kariko? I think it's Kari Kariko. No, it's Hatino, because it's where the tech lab is. So, I'm just gonna travel back there. Ah, uh, because that's where we'll start the next video, because I think... One last thing I would like to do is pick up some board quests and I'd like to make a trip into the research area to see if we can do anything. Um, but for now, we're just teleporting there just so I know where to start in the next video. Um, but yeah, so I hope you enjoyed this one and we'll see you in the next one. Bye guys.